Hello, second graders. I miss you all very much. Um, I did have a little allergic reaction and I've been, um, was in the hospital. I just got out, but I'm getting these lessons done for you and I miss you and we'll do the best we can. So, um, the composer that we're reviewing today is Felix Mendelssohn. I'm going to review this and then I'm going to ask the substitute under standard four, which is the, one of the last columns in my grade book to write Mendelssohn. And then you will have each one of the students say one of these facts from below. Um, and if they say something, they can repeat what somebody else has said. If they say something good, you give them a four. Remember, they all know, right kiddos, that everybody has to say something. If you don't say anything, you do have to get a zero. So make sure you raise your hand and say something about Felix Mendelssohn. And if a student is absent to the substitute, please write ABS uh, under the, the column on the in my grade sheets. So Felix Mendelssohn, who's the brother of Fanny Mendelssohn Hansel, who we already learned about. Felix was born in Germany in 1809 and he died in 1847. He was the younger brother of Fanny Mendelssohn Hensel, who we learned about, and he only lived to be 38. His family was very wealthy, which means they were rich, they had a lot of money. Um, he played the piano and violin and the organ. He toured all around the country, that means he went from place to place to place, um, playing um, the piano and conducting while also teaching and composing. So he was very, very busy. His life and his schedule was very busy or hectic. He was very saddened by the death of his sister. Um, and he actually died at 38 due to overwork and sadness. So um, the substitute in just a second is going to turn up when this video is done. The substitute is going to have you all say something about Felix Mendelssohn. Make sure you raise your hands, show the substitute how well you know how to do this. And when you're done with everybody saying something, you are going to listen to the Violin Concerto by uh, Felix Mendelssohn. Remember, a violin concerto means the violin is the star. If it was a flute concerto, the flute would be the star. If it was a piano concerto, the piano would be the star. But with it being a violin concerto, um, the violin is the star. And I want you, as you listen to it after you've all made your comments, I want you to pretend to be the violinist playing the violin, or you can pretend to be the conductor uh, that you know stands up in front and conducts the person playing, or you can just sit quietly and listen because one of my goals in music is to have you love music and just enjoy music and participate. So um, everybody's gonna do their comment and then you're gonna listen to Antonio, uh, Antonio Vival, Felix Mendelssohn's violin concerto and do one of those things. All right, I hope you um, have fun. I miss you. All right, turning it over to the substitute right now.